Hello, Jackie here with the July Project Club from Dimension Stamps. I've already cut out all my card, so I'll quickly go through the measurements. My base card I cut at 14.8 centimetres, so then I went down in half centimetre increments. So my coloured card measures 14.3 centimetres square, my white card is 13.8 centimetres square, and my leftover bits. The coloured card measures 12.5 cm by 6.5 cm and the white card measures 6 cm by 12 cm. We're going to start by stamping our background. So we need our white card. I'm going to use a piece of scrap paper so I don't get ink all over my mat. We need our memento ink and we need the stamp which is a citrus slice so it can be oranges, lemons or limes. So we need to ink up and we're going to randomly stamp around the edge of this white card, letting it fall over the edge. Try not to overlap the stamps because we're going to do a fill bit in between. So just as many as you want and wherever you want. Now I've already cut out three post-it notes, so covering your first image like so, use another one to cover next to it and then we're going to stamp in between. And then we're going to move this post-it note and move it onto this one. A little bit of a wide gap there but we've got plenty of room to cover as we go. So I'll have to move that one down. to use this other little piece to cover that. Here's one I previously coloured in. I used Pro Markers to colour mine, and now we're going to move on to the shrink plastic. You'll find a piece of shrink plastic in your pack, and we're going to stamp a citrus slice using the stays on ink. To prepare your shrink plastic, we use a sanding block and sanding up and down, from left and right, gives it a little bit of a rough texture to stamp on. I've already coloured and cut out the citrus slice. I've used a watercolour pencil. You don't actually need a lot of colour on there because it will go darker when you shrink it down. So just to finish it off with a water brush, 
brings the colour out a little bit more. And now we're going to shrink it. turnover and then using your acrylic block just to flatten it out and that's all it takes we're now going to use our smallest piece of white card and the glass a bit of memento ink And we're going to use the smallest of the two umbrellas. The sentiment. And then the little ice cube. We're going to use second generation ink. So I have a piece of scrap paper. Put in as much or as little ice as you need. We're now going to colour with Pro Markers. Here's one I coloured earlier, and now we're going to matte and layer our card. So now our card's been matte and layered, we need to just add our piece of shrink plastic. So you could either use a glue dot or some silicone glue. And there we have the finished card. I hope you enjoy your stamps this month. Thank you. Bye.